Hai, Assalamualaikum Hi everyone, my name is Muhammad Fulizakun bin Muhammad Farouk My name is Muharif Fikri bin Muhammad Isabiri My name is Wan Arabika Yudhu Wan Muhammad Zahidi And I'm Ahmad Fahid Sharizi bin Ahmad Taufik We are from Science Langon Secondary School of Malaysia Introducing our new innovative project Solvable film, food wrap and packaging or food file Do you ever think how many plastic there are always in our world? This is how many plastic has been used and waste in our world. As written by New York Street Times, Malaysia is the second in Asia for annual per capita plastic use and eighth among nations that mismanage plastic waste. This issue is very worrying for the future of our country. Through this project, we are now offering a potential solution. Soluble film, food wrap and project or so far is an alternative to reduce the waste management problem, especially for the food industry. Our first objective is to reduce the waste of plastic. We also want to create environmental consciousness in people's mind to be a better and greener world for future generations. Moreover, our second objective is we can stop the pollution of microplastics in our food. Based on previous research, microplastic can transfer from a gut to a fillet, but we show widespread of occurrence in wild fish. Around 74% of fillets and 63% of livers had at least one microplastic presence, while 99% of, of fish had at least one particle in any of the three studied issues. After that, our third objective is that seaweed can be a problem solver for climate change, as seaweed store around 175 million tons of carbon or 10% of the emissions from cars around the world. Last but not least, more demand for seaweed will help generate revenue for seaweed farmers and at the same time, strengthen the country's economy. First, we need to prepare a potassium hydroxide solution consisting of 200 grams of potassium hydroxide and 2 liters of water. Next, heat the solution until it reaches 60 degrees Celsius and place 100 grams of seaweed in the solution and leave it for 2 hours and slowly the solution will react with seaweed. Then, blend the raw materials into smaller pieces and sanitize it with a regular chlorine bleach solution. Moreover, filter the seaweed and rinse it with water. Then, soak the seaweed and add 50 ml of sodium thiosulfate and 0.5 grams of ascorbic acid for 2 hours and rinse it with water until the smell of chlorine is gone. Next, soak the seaweed for another 12 hours to completely clean the seaweed. Then, combine 3 grams of the moist seaweed, 3 grams of starch, 2 grams of farmer's glycerin, and 2 grams of sorbitol. Mix it in 0.5 liters of water. After that, boil it in a microwave. Finally, pour the liquid into a non-stick pan and wait until dry. Based on our analysis, the world has 1.9 million tons of seaweed in 2019. With seaweed as our main ingredients, we expected that the number of seaweed in the ocean will increase and that the seaweed will help in boosting country economy. We also expected that the rate of climate change will slow down because seaweed store a lot of carbon that is emitted. So, our hypothesis is, the more the number of seaweeds, the less the global warming. The sustainable, renewable and biodegradable properties from seaweed have made them an evolving source of substitute to the currently massive petrol-based plastic as food packaging. The functional performance of plant-based biodegradable materials can provide boundless potential for improving food quality, packaging and safety while combating the ecological pollution. All from us, thank you.